an airliner that will carry travelers around the world for decades to come that just made its first appearance. The 787 Dreamliner, it's called. It was rolled out at Boeing's Everett Washington plant in a ceremony befitting its importance to Boeing's future. Richard Quest was there. With as much fanfare as Boeing could muster, the 787 Dreamliner was shown for the first time. This is a medium-sized plane with big ambitions, designed to carry up to 250 people. It will fly long routes, for instance, Los Angeles to Sydney or London to Singapore. It is a plane that carries the future of Boeing along with it. To make the world a smaller place and in so doing, bringing all of us closer together. The Dreamliner is a different type of aircraft, made mainly from composite materials, not metal. It means it's very light and gives airlines great fuel efficiency, up to 20% better than current aircraft. We knew that we had to design a product with a deep appreciation and concern for the environment and for airport communities. From the start, airlines have voted in favor for this aircraft. 47 carriers have bought the plane. And the best part of 700 planes are now on order. So it's the most successful rollout ever. Singapore Airlines has bought 20 planes with an option on 20 more. Well, if it delivers on all its uh, design targets and what Boeing promises, it will be a game changer. The plane will now go into eight of intense flight testing. The first commercial model will be delivered in May. This is an extremely ambitious timescale for an aircraft that has so much new technology. We know how to lay out flight test programs. Uh, we've done a lot of risk reduction testing uh, already in the program to eliminate uh, things that typically happen to you in flight tests. Uh, we understand how we've structured the program. We've got a lot of confidence that we're going to get this thing done and done on time. Boeing are keen to ensure the Dreamliner doesn't suffer the fate of the A380, where delays have soured the project. The battle between Boeing and Airbus will continue for many years to come. But, as the long list of airline logos on this plane shows, the future of Boeing is resting on the wings of this plane. And for the time being at least, the Dreamliner has made Boeing's dreams come true. Richard Quest, CNN, at the Boeing factory outside Seattle.